over 700 Transformers characters, these are the greatest Transformers drawings of all time that I've done. To celebrate my 10th year anniversary on YouTube, today I'm going to show you some of the greatest drawings I've ever done on this channel that are Transformers. Are you James, the box office artist? Uh, I am? My name is Optimus Prime. So let's start with this piece. This is my recreation of the 1984 Transformers movie poster. Next is the very first most detailed drawing ever I've ever done on this channel. This one is very close to my heart. This is Transformers Metroplex.
Now the next one is actually a commission that I was asked to do. He wanted me to draw a very 1984 G1 Optimus Prime versus Megatron. is one of my favorites another most detailed drawing ever this was for tfcon when they invited me to be a guest i draw transformers devastate
next one, at the time IDW still had the Transformers license, now I believe it's with Skybound now, but they asked me to do a cover for Optimus Prime. So I decided to draw this very detailed version of Trypticon. IDW over the years. In fact, I've done a lot of work with Transforms in general over the years. And what you are seeing now is some of the covers, the different covers and the different work I've done over the years from Dreamwave to IDW. And it's always a lot of fun doing these Transformers covers. And speaking of Transformers covers, this was my return to comics in a long time. IDW asked me to do a very short story in the back of one of their issues that revealed the introduction of Unicron to their Transformers universe. So I was the first one to draw.
band they enjoy that so much, they asked me to do this six part connecting cover with not just Transformers, but also G.I. Joe, Visionaries, ROM, and Micronauts. sentimental one um, I had a fan who uh, messaged me and him and his uh, now wife uh, were big Transformers fans and she was a big fan of Starscream so he wanted to propose to her <laughs> the way he wanted to propose to her was to get her a custom Starscream piece from me and, and first of all I was extremely honored that he wanted me to do that for them and I put as much detail as I could, I put my heart and soul into this star screen piece because, you know, uh, hopefully it meant a lifetime of happiness for them. And here's the piece.
next piece I did in collaboration with Cybertron.com a few years back, I wanted to do a Transformers and G.I. Joe movie kind of mashup piece. Like we haven't seen both of them in the movies together, so I thought that would be a lot of fun. I got the people on the message board to suggest which characters to include into this piece. And it was a lot of fun to do. So here is the hero version.
is the villain. Transformers movies, this was one of my favorite Transformers movies that they've done. This is my tribute to Bumblebee. Next one you are very familiar with. This is my favorite Transformers drawing I've done on this channel. This is my most detailed drawing ever of Unicron.
might be saying, James, you know, that's a, that's a lot of characters. Sure, maybe over 100 or so characters, but you said 700. Well, let's take care of 600 of them right now. Now, unfortunately, I never filmed myself drawing this because I did this piece a few years back. I did this Transformers mural, 600 characters that was released as a lithograph. And let me take you through this piece right now. Let's start off, I don't exactly remember which piece uh, started in which issue. Okay, so again, with each issue of uh, Transformers G1, each one had a double page spread. There were six issues, so each one would have, there would be a variant. With one variant cover, you would have one poster. With the other variant cover, you would have the other poster. So for each of these pieces, I had a particular theme. This was a G1 uh, theme piece here. You see Starscream in here. Uh, you see a Hot Rod in here, which is actually more G2, but uh, you'll see Rodimus uh, later on. So Iron Ironhide here. Uh, Jazz here, like you'll see all the classic G1 characters. So you see Grimlock here, the Dinobots over there. So this was a G1 centric piece. The alternate was this one. Now for those of you who uh, don't remember, this is actually, yeah, a lot of these characters here are Transformers Armada characters. So uh, you can see this is uh, Transformers Armada Megatron. This is Cyclonus, I believe. This is Starscream. Some of these are G1 characters here. We have the Constructicons here. So this one here, I believe this is a G2 piece. Yeah, this is mostly G2 characters and movie characters. You got six shot here at the front. So every single piece I did here, I did want like one main um, character in the front. So most of these guys are G2 uh, characters. So I, we had this guidebook that I looked at through the generations and I wanted to make sure each piece, they were, you know, grouped together. And of course you see Unicron here. And I'll show you how that connects to the Optimus piece. These ones here, this is also Transformers Armada. Again, Transformers Armada Optimus. Um, I think he was Red Alert. This is Bumblebee. Um, so this, uh, yeah, so that was the Armada. And then of course we have Metroplex, a G1 Metroplex here. And then G1 characters along the bottom here. So you see Optimus here. Okay, and then this is the Megatron. This is again the G1 area here. G1 area. So we got Megatron here. I got, this is probably Thundercracker because I had Starscream on the other side, I believe. This is either Starscream or Thundercracker. So other side. Uh, Mirage here. Like again, all the, most of the G1 stuff. Then we have the top part here. And this is... Beast Wars. This is Beast Wars here, and that's a Beast Wars Megatron. So all of these characters here at the top, these are all uh, Beast Wars characters here on the top. And that was a lot of fun to do. And then we have a Galvatron here. And again, most of this is G2 characters here. We have we have uh, the, the Optimus with the, you know, the small Optimus <laughs> inside here. I remember those. Those are pretty cool. You have RC here. And now we have all the combiners. This was one of my favorite ones uh, because all of these guys are combiners. They're combiners and then the in individual robots. They were, they were here as well. And of course Omega Supreme right here. And then uh, you see the humans here. We have uh, the characters here in vehicle mode. No, no, I believe I had this. I, I actually had this toy. I forgot his name. So I had Ultra Magnus here at the front. Uh, here we got Rodimus there and all that. Now, yeah, I do wish now looking at it that I drew a little bit more of these guys, but can't complain. A lot of full body. Transformers Rid series. Um, the reason I, I drew these guys big, because Rid, Transformers are Rid, back in, uh, I think that was 2000. Uh, that's a little near and dear to me, because uh, me and my friend Chris Saracini, we, we put together this three-pager uh, Rid story, and that three-pager, it actually solidified uh, Dreamwave's deal to get the Transformers license. We sent that along with the images that Pat did and that really helped sell us uh, getting the license at that time. So a lot of these guys are Rid characters. Here, again, more Transformers Armada characters here on the top and uh, more vehicles here. Now actually these are also Transformers Armada vehicles as well. Again, the reason why I, I really pushed the Armada was because I was working on the series at the time. So you can see here, that's me. Uh, that's my buddy Eric who inked this whole thing. He's a crazy, crazy, crazy guy. And um, Alan, Alan colored the whole thing. Kenny was the uh, flatter. So all of these 12 pieces, all stitched together, and this is what you get.
But that's not all. To finish off this video and to thank you again for 10 wonderful years on YouTube, I'm going to show you one of my favorite videos on this channel in collaboration with my mentor and good friend Jazza. This is me drawing 30 plus Optimus Primes. Hello? James? James Reyes, yeah, that's the, box, the box office artist, is, this, is that you? Is that who I'm speaking to? Yeah, yeah, that's me, that's me. You're the guy who draws uh, Transformers and, and I'm, I'm known to draw Transformers, Great, yeah. great, yeah. just the guy I'm looking for. Uh, so one okay. of my clients, uh, his name is uh, 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 Optimus, Pr Optimus Prime. Optimus He's a Prime. Transformer. Uh, and, and he's been looking for someone to do an artwork for him. We're helping find him. We found you. Oh, you talking about Peter uh, Cullen? We can only pay you in Energon cubes, but is that something Energon you're interested cubes? in? How much is that worth? Okay, great. He'll be there to pick it up in, in 48 hours. 48 is that enough hours? Time? Good, okay. 48 uh, good hours? Good luck and uh, making your art. I'm sure he'll, he'll love it. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. 48 hours, wait, 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 uh, wait. Uh, hold on. And I'll see you later. Wait, Bye. hey, hey, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. So it was Optimus Prime's agent. So I can only assume he's talking about Peter Cullen. Peter Cullen is the quintessential voice of Optimus Prime. I did meet him once in China, but it would be great to meet him again. And I thought this was a great opportunity to make a piece for my childhood hero. So should I make just one big Optimus Prime and add a lot of detail to it? Nah, there are a lot of Optimus Primes that were made over the years. So I knew this couldn't be just any piece. I wanted to make this the ultimate Optimus Prime piece. For the first 24 hours, I'm gonna try to draw as many of them as I can. and each one took a lot of time. But I was having so much fun drawing all of them, I haven't drawn Optimus Prime in a while, that the hours kind of flew by. Hey James, buddy, how's it going? Um, uh, my client, uh, Opt Optimistic Prime, is uh, looking forward to your stuff. You done? Doing great. Uh, 12 hours left to go on the drawing, and then uh, gonna do some color. Don't be late.
protection and my safe protection I will always be around Will it ever get sunny? Oh, I want it, honey I'm tired of being in Hey James, can you hear me? I'm uh, just checking in uh, on your th uh, whatever it is you're doing for Optometrist Prime. It's coming along. I, I think I've done the line art here. I just got to start the color now. All right, don't be late. He uh, he doesn't like it when people are late. Well, oh, okay, okay, I'll get on it. Not like I have anything better to do. <laughs> Artist, get a real job. Okay. James, James, uh, just let you know, uh, uh, Amazon Prime is on his way, and he, uh, you're um, running. Uh, I think you have about uh, an hour, so an hour left. Anyway, just good luck, buddy, and I'm sure he'll love it. He expects nothing less than perfection. All right, all right, I got it, I got it. Oh, hey, James, uh, Amazon Prime uh, is on its way. Yep, just done, just on the nick of time. Now, listen, I'm going to forward you the address. Um, just meet him there. Uh, bring an unmarked car. Okay, good luck, buddy, and um, be safe. Peter? Peter? This is the spot. Hello? Peter? Excuse me. Are you James, the box office artist? Uh, I am. My name is Optimus Prime. <laughs> the real Optimus, you're here! You're from. I, I, I can't believe it, my name is James, I've been a fan all my life, I loved you ever since I was a kid, I love all your movies, I love The Last Night. I, Let's I, not talk about that. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, but I thought I was going to meet Peter Cullen, but the real Optimus Prime right in front of me. I can't believe it. I'm a big fan of your work, James, and I have heard great things about you. I also heard that you have something for me. Uh, uh, yeah, I got I got a drawing here. It, it took me quite a while. Yes, it's for you. Okay, okay, here you go. Here you go. Wow. Magnificent. From here on out, you are an honorary Autobot. Really? <laughs> I, I am honored. I am, I'm so honored. Thank you so much. Roll out. <laughs> what? The real Optimus Prime. I can't, what? I can't believe that. The real Optimus Prime. Thank you guys for your support. If you are interested in any of these pieces as prints, I will be opening up my store very, very soon. When it does open, you'll find a link down below and I will announce it as well. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for 10 wonderful years. My name is James. I am the box office artist. I'll see you next time.